Cliff. The fiscal cliff is in the United Streets of Armageddon. Top of the morning to you. Top of the morning. It's now Happy New Year in New York and all across, well, an eastern seaboard. And uh, places in Canada. Top of the morning to you all out there. Top of the morning. This is in Crack Paul McDougal live on the streets of Glasgow, bringing it live and direct, coming live and direct in the streets of Glasgow. Five in the morning now, we're five in the morning. We've had a brilliant night since the laughs left. I used Jonas earlier on, putting the, the jinx on us. I couldn't make any poppy. The money has been made, and loads of money has been made. So thank you very much. And we're back in the town almost, back in the town almost, causing again, Happy New Year. Happy New Year to my good brothers over in the Eastern Seaboard. Happy New Year. If you're in Boston, you can call me on 617-963-0967. This is Tommy in Glasgow, Thomas J. Clark, the third from Celtic Community Radio. And we're driving through the streets of Glasgow and a Pirates Are Us session here. Another Pirates Are Us earlier on, it was Panbreed. And uh, we're probably going to get back into the tune and it's Panbreed, because I'll use Jonas are back. But that's why I brought you in to help me out. Help keep me happy, insane, or crazy, insane. Who knows, who cares? Now we're almost back in here, yeah, good morning. All across the planet, all across the globe tonight. So thank you very much for joining me. 2013, 2013. Let's see, can we get a crackpot on the line here? Let's see if we can do with this technology. Driving through the streets of Glasgow here. The person whom you're trying to reach is currently unavailable. Currently unavailable, no chance there. Try to get through to North America. Come in North America. We're going fiscal cliffing in the USA. The person whom you're trying to reach is currently unavailable. Currently unavailable. It's crackpot McDougal time across the planet. Everybody out there tripping out their dials with flannel juice and gibberish. Big shout out to every crackpot internet bam pot on the Twitter tonight. And all the Celtic folks. Forums across the planet. Hail, hail. We started 2012 top of the league. We finished at top of the league. We saw the demise of Sevco. We won the league. We defeated the best team in the world. We are the champions 
of the world, the Glasgow Celtic champions. We're on our way to Wembley. You better add them and Eva. This is Cash and Carry FM. Cash and Carry, Crackpot McDougall, live in the streets of Glasgow. We brought a show earlier on. Unlike the people from Glasgow City Council, no show, no cameras. Glasgow was not in show to the world because there was nothing happening in Glasgow. Apart from Celtic Community Radio making our debut, Thomas J. Clark here, Celtic Community Radio making our debut on the streets of Glasgow, Pirates of Us fashion. The person whom you're trying to reach is currently unavailable. Please leave a message after the beep. Well, Cole Orson, Kim and Orson. Anybody there? Is there anybody there? All right, the Christmas light is on in Glasgow. The Christmas tree light is on. All the rest of the lights are on, but the Christmas tree is on in Glasgow, George Square. All the amusement and all the stuff all around, but they used to take down. They've decided it's better to keep it up there, raking the money for the punters instead of providing a display or a show. The times are a-changing. Austerity measures. Everybody in Glasgow, or a lot of people in Glasgow, sits in their house now. Sits in their house getting mad with it. With the old Chinsano listening to the Lena Martel. At least in a parrot household anyway. He's on the non-alcoholic Chinsano. With a heavily addictive Lena Martel. <laughs> And we're in the streets of Glasgow, giving it yaldi. Six minutes past five. Six minutes past five. All right, Trips, who's out there? Chaz Duffy, Happy New Year! Jim Kinlan, how you doing? Happy New Year. Chaz, what's happening, my man? Let's get it going down. You're in New York, mate. Let me make use of my subscription. Here's your number. Let's get it on to New York. Let's take you into the streets of Glasgow, into Mitchell Street at Gordon Street, where I'm sitting right now. Come ahead if you think you're hard enough. Give me a phone call in Boston, a one-ring sting, and I'll phone you right back. 617-963-0967. Don't be shy, give it a try. We're driving down Mitchell Lane now, past Diamond Dolls. Diamond Dolls to the night, to the right. We'll be shut tonight. Passing Tingle, the shooter bar and cafe. I know as we head down on the left-hand side, we're passing the Celtic shop. We're passing the Celtic shop on our Gill Street. Join today to receive exclusive offers and events available to young hoots, clubs only members, zero to three and four to fourteen membership season 2012-2013. Sale, save up to 50% on selected items at Celtic Shop on the corner of Agel Street and Mitchell Lane. As we drive along past Evans, past Ann Summers, G Star Raw, Super Dry, GAP, and we're stuck at the lights. So give us a call, don't be shy. Jim from Sydney, how you doing, brother? How you doing, my man? Give us your number, mate. Put your number in or send it to me on Skype. Or give me a one ring sting. Give me a one ring sting and I'll phone you right back to the room, brother. Let's get down here. Where you going, my man? 
No, mate, no. No. No, mate, the lights. Can I stop here? There's motors coming. Try to get me to jail. Stevenson Street. Moody's wrecking through Stevenson Street. Uh, we could pull in here. Nah, nothing happening there. Right. So look at that. In the chat room tonight, we have a brother in Sydney and we have a brother in New York. So what I say is, why don't you both give us a call and out? I'll reverse the charges and I'll phone you both back if you do a one ring sting. And we do a three-way call all across the planet this new year. Now that we're all celebrating New Year in Sydney, Glasgow, and New York. So the American number is 9617-963-0967. The Melbourne number is 03 9013-6767. Right. Yeah, it's the stragglers, the last of the deadbeats are on Glasgow streets here. It's deadbeats are us. Deadbeats and pirates are us. Pirates are us in the streets of Glasgow, 10 past 5. Glasgow, crackpot meantime. 10 past 5, crackpot meantime. We're now passing the Gala Casino. We're now in the Merchant City. The old Merchant City. And it's died a death now. I told you you were fucking Jonas. I told you you were Jonas. Right, here's a brother phoning in. Oh, one night. Right, hang up. Hang up and I'll phone you right back, bro. It's free calls for me. Hang right up. Hang right up. Hang right up. I'll phone you back, right? We have a bite, we have a fish in the sea. Right, I take it, oh, one, that was a USA number. If we've got the brother in Sydney, you can give us a call as well, brother. Let's get this going down here. Right, pull in in the nice safety. In the nice safety of the Merchant City. And we're going to give us number a call here, recent one. There we go. Fiscal cliffing in the USA. We're going fiscal cliffing in the USA here. Hi, sorry I can't get to the phone right now. Leave my name on the button, I'll give you a call back. All right. Hey. Oh. Right, what's this? We got our number. Six one is Australia. Hang up, Ben. Hang up. I forgot you're in Australia. Let's see. Hello. Hey, you going, Tommy? Who's that? Is this a brother over in Australia, Jim? Australia. Hi, it's Jim. How are you, mate? No bad, mate. No bad. Happy New Year. And happy New Year to yourself. I didn't think you'd be up at this bloody time. Aye, mate. I never sleep, mate. Yeah, I know. I know. But Christ, I thought the night you might have been somewhere past it or something. No, I don't drink, mate. I don't drink. I'm totally. I do, no. I'm out here. I'm out here taxi driving. The taxi driver of the. Oh, that's right. Of course, I. Been busy. Related. How's things anyway, mate? Aye. Okay. Oh, brilliant, man. I'm just working on the last six or seven days, but day after day, and it's a scorcher. Is it, aye? It's a bit, uh, it's a bit too hot to tell you, it's just sitting in the shade drinking a beer. Man, what time was here? About half three in the afternoon or something. What, what temperature you talking about? Did you have a good Christmas? Aye, mate, aye. It was lovely, mate. Yourself, it was your family. Aye. Uh, oh, we're all, all, yeah, all good, mate. I won't miss it, but, but it was all it's good. Aye. No, it's just, it's funny just to, I was just on Twitter and I just seen your handle just saying that you're doing a show and I think, Christ, that's 10 in the morning, have a wee look, but I'm guessing most people are in bed anyway. <laughs> Hi mate, well I'm, I'm out to ca ca capture the crackpot market in Australia, in New York, everywhere mate. Yeah, I know, I'm out to catch you in the world, man. 
<laughs> so it's all about, mate. You don't find Clyde in a show like this, mate? You do not, not man. <laughs> Drive, driving about I, in a tinfoil covered Skoda at fucking uh, Hug Money looking for a fare, talking to your brother over in Australia. <laughs> there's, still, there's, there's still many people walking the streets. Aye, aye, there's still a few, mate. I'm just, I'll pull in here, I'm just, I'm outside a, a little distillery here, so either there is, mate, there was a few bufters kicking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Head, there's a, there's a, yeah. a wee illegal party they have, uh, the arches was on, and so when the arches is on, they've got a wee illegal party that goes on just over the south side. So, oh, you know that, yeah. Uh, so, I'm going to batter over there, and uh, once, once uh, the casino goes, saying that there's a casino, it's open 24-7, so. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, it's craziness here in Glasgow now, the city that never sleeps now, eventually. We've moved, we've, moved with the we've moved with the times, we can be trusted to have a a, a 24 hour drinking culture, just about anyway. God, that's, that's, that's alright. I mean, it's, it was like when I first came out here to Australia, that was the one thing I noticed, is that they didn't really have, well, they've got license and laws, but they seem really relaxed. If you're in the city itself, man, even, I don't know, 15 years ago or something like that, there was, Pubs had just never shut. You know, they'd, they'd shut down between a Sunday and a Monday and they'd basically open all, all day, no, no, 24 hours or 30 hours or something. Aye. Here we go. But, um, no, nah, Where are you going? Where are you going? I mean, I better... Hello? No, no. No, so I'm just haggling here, mate. I'm just haggling. Somebody came up to you there. I'm just outside the casino here. Somebody's come up to me. I'm just ah, about okay. to do a bit of haggling. <laughs> but it's all right. That's all right. Yeah, fair. <laughs> no, no, they were asking for a name, but I don't take names, I just take cash at this time of night. <laughs> ah, well, fair enough, that's fair enough. <laughs> so what did you do for the Bells then, mate? I was, phoning, I was doing a show mate, earlier on. I was, no, I was I've, I've, got, um, I've got a wee um, three-year-old Tommy. So, so a, bit, it's a, bit, a bit difficult for me and the wife to get part in during the night when I've got him. But they had, uh, the, the club that we go to, they, they had um, early fireworks going for the kids at nine o'clock. So we took him at nine o'clock. He, you know, he's seen the fireworks before, but he can't really remember them. So he's seen all the fireworks show at nine o'clock and just got him back to bed about ten o'clock and we just stayed in the house and just a few drinks ourselves well, before going to bed. That was the time I did a show. So what, what time would that be, nine o'clock? Would that be about half twelve, one o'clock? Your time back here, eh? Nah, I, I, I get back in the house at ten o'clock, which would have been about... Oh, I wasn't a close your time, but we, I stayed up with the missus and that, and we just had a few drinks ourselves and spoke to a few people on the phone and that ourselves. Oh, I wasn't listening to the end. No, well, but I, did, I, I did a show, Sydney, and I was yeah, phoning, I, was I phoned up Sydney, and it was at half nine Everywhere. at night at Sydney, and then it was, oh. as, as, what, 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 and then, what, 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 so you're, you're on the west coast, isn't it? No, Sydney's on the east coast, isn't it? No, I, east, east coast, I, I, No, what it was, it was Perth, sorry, it was Perth, I phoned Perth, it was at, at half nine at night, and, and then when I phoned... Uh, I was trying. Right. I, I tried at an Adelaide radio station, and eventually get through a, a Sydney radio station, a talk radio station. And they're quite keen to put me on. As soon as I phoned through with a Scottish accent, they pushed me up the yeah, rankings, yeah, yeah. and, and they, were, they were dead keen to get me on. So if you if you tune back I in, you hear. Ah, but it's it still on there. I, 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 I yeah, I'll listen to the podcast. I'll listen to the podcast. I'll listen. Because I, I was desperate to get somebody. Uh, uh, celebrating the thing, so eventually, actually, I think I got ah. somebody in a New Zealand radio station, somebody in Auckland. I was trying to get ah, a Sydney, okay. one. I, I couldn't get through Sydney. And I tried, I tried the one in Adelaide, and it was the one in, yeah. I got through the one in Perth. And uh, ah, right. yeah, I, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I was just wanting to get say, say happy New Year to somebody over there, but I didn't ah, know the no, time difference enough. was that fucking massive. Between, oh, a, yeah, no, it's a, eleven hours to you. No, but I'm talking yeah, about so from Perth, yeah. from Perth, from Perth. Yeah. To, oh, I saw that. It's a big traffic. Yeah. Three years difference. I didn't, I didn't even know that. I, yeah, yeah, no. Right. I, you know the joke that way people back in, because some of my pals just have an idea back in Scotland about Australia. Yeah, it takes them, it takes as long to fly from Glasgow to Turkey as it does to fly from Perth to Sydney. <laughs> it's, it's that distance. It takes six hours on a plane sometimes. Yeah. Or five hours if you get a quick one. But yeah, I know there's all these different time zones, but fair enough. Hi mate, uh, Tommy, I better go back, I'll get a wee man who'll come in, tell me to come back inside, I'm going to get my dinner ready yeah, you know. and in the early afternoon to you today, we're going out the night. God bless you, have again, a good mate. day, have a good day mate, take care. Speak to you soon again, mate. Tommy. Speak to you soon, and, thank um, you mate. I'll speak to you sooner. God bless bye, you, bye. have a good day, take care. There we go. Let's see if we can get this good brother back here from the USA. 
Fisco cliffing in the USA. Crackpot phoning in the USA. Hello. Hello. Hello, Tommy. Hi. Happy to hear, man. How you doing? How you doing? Is that Chaz Duffy? Hi. Happy New Year, brother. Bro, you mate, you celebrate? Do you celebrate the New York and Uber about, sir, are you? Well, uh, I'm just in the house. Yeah, we're watching the big ball drop in there on the telly. I missed that, mate. So, uh, I was... I was... Get, I missed uh, that, but aye. Family over the wife's uh, father's over and we got a couple of... Uh, this is over from Ireland, so we just have done a bit of road and come down and watch it on the telly. Right. And uh, everybody's just ready for bed, right now we start in the morning, we're going to go and do some touristy stuff and bring them in. So is a much place open quiet. tomorrow then? Is it, is, it a, is it a place where it's everything's open then tomorrow, aye? Is it? Aye, uh, well, there's the lassies one, there's two young lassies there, they want to do the Empire State Building. So right, we've been there, we were downtown yesterday, it was just madness. Was so it, we want to get down. Doing early doors tomorrow and get some of the tourists and stuff done and then before we head home. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well. That's good, mate. Aye, mate, it was busy earlier on, aye, when I was out about, came in about one o'clock, it took a wee while to get kicked off, but aye, it finally kicked off and it's, eh, uh, aye, the dying embers just all the last mad few fucking crackpots left to go, so. I'm Is there anything happening in there on the job square or anything like that? No, there's nothing. That, all, all they've got there is uh, just all the stuff like the big tree and the, the ice rink and the they've not got a big wheel this time. They've got to just get a wee few shows and all that and a, a, a mad cafe. So, uh, but no, there's, there's nothing. Parties, no? no, nothing at all, nothing at all. They've gave that up. I don't know if it's austerity or they just don't want all the crazy bastards about, which <laughs> I suppose it's a good thing because when you see all the bastards, I think it used to put a lot of people get off as well, you know what I mean? It's just fucking... They're better, they're, I suppose it's better to keep them in the, their own schemes, you know what I mean? It's, it saves, it saves a crossover for the schemes wanting to fucking cause it with each other. <laughs> but so so <laughs> far, no problems. No, I know. So far, no problems, no fights. I've not seen anything happening, so it's been a oh, quiet night. Happy night. Nice and peaceful for 2013, huh? Where you going, my man? No, oh, Don, here we go. 40 quid. 40 quid? <laughs> I've got a fair, I'm only kidding. <laughs> I've got a fair, I'm waiting for somebody to go in the north end. Sorry, pal. I need to be careful there, there's a black cat behind me there. I need to be careful before I go fucking crashing up to the black cat. Aye, <laughs> <laughs> right, no, but listen, I'll let you go. You're up early tomorrow then, Chaz, aye? Aye, we're up there. We're going to be downtown. The Empire Fields, eight o'clock. So we're going to there bright and early and get as much drum done there tomorrow as we can and uh, just show the wee girls the sights and the, the old uh, device feather and show them about the place for a bit. So we took them out to start now on the last day. As um, so I said, it'll be the, the cash and carry fucking tourist stuff. You can't land in the Liberty Island anymore, so the closest you can get is Statue of Liberty to the Staten Island Ferry, which is free. So we've been out to the Staten Island and come straight back. Again, do a couple of nice pictures from all that and some of that stuff. You must, but, you um, must. Hit, just leave it to you, here, you, you know, are you know, sick of getting all the sightseeing stuff because you must get have to get height to ruin any time anybody new comes over to see you. Ah, uh, I no, it's it's not good to do it there again. Uh, and, uh, uh, it's just good to do it like you know, I mean, we're all at the top of the rock. I'm not going to pass the old more time than fucking King Kong at this stage. Um, that's good old crack like that. It's good to hear. You never get bored in New York. It's, it's always top to days. Well done, Charles. Spring Springburn? How much do you want to pay, brother? How much? Call it 30, we get a deal. Uh-huh, you don't want to pay 30. You want to pay 20. <laughs> Normal times I would take them for a score to Springburn, but fucking hell. January's a long oh, month right. and February's even longer. By the time the bills start hitting, you know what I mean? <laughs> God bless me, thanks for phoning me. The and all the boys. Uh, keep up the good work and uh, fuck those clean bastards.
That's it, mate. I'm going to do, do something regular, mate. Hopefully we get a chance to speak. Monday, 6 o'clock. Tuesday, Wednesday as well. We'll get a chance to speak, mate, with you the cud with all different people. Uh, so, thank you very much, all right, sorry. God bless, mate. Right. Hail, hail. Hail, hail, mate. Uh, you can't say fair than that. From Sydney to New York. And in between a few pirate offers in the streets of Glasgow. <laughs> Fifty quid round the corner. Hi. How much you answer, mate? Hi. Where are you going? How much? Thirty quid. Hi. Right, you're a famous football player. Right, you? Reggie Blinker. Let's <laughs> go down. How much are you talking? You're a famous gangster. Forty quid. A heavy gig gangster. <laughs> Hell yeah, fifty bangers in. Oh mate, oh mate, I'm tired of this time, mate. It's New Year, twenty-five and a five or tip. Fuck mate, I need to wait for my fare, mate. Sorry, buddy. There we go, Pirates are us, daily in the streets of Glasgow, Ragamuffin, Springburn, what time is it, 25 past 5, live in the streets of Glasgow, cash and carry, Pirates are us, across the planet, you can call us, we've got numbers for every city in the world almost, we've now added to the collection a lovely number in London, for any brain dead, daft zombies, we always knew that it would be a sticking point for you to phone the 416-1888 number or any other number with 67. So as part of a, a lovely wee package and to help fool a few zombies when I phone them, I've got a number of 0203-290-1690. There you go. If you're a brain daft zombie any over, anywhere in London, phone me on 0203 290 6090. <laughs> the offer was too good to be true. And uh, I thought I'd go for it for a laugh, for a New Year laugh, go for a 1690 number to hook in the zombies. Is that, is that the Arkela? If that's the Arkela, we're off here. Oh, it's alright, we're alright. This place has gone pan breed. I told you you were fucking Jonas. Hell on, I couldn't get a fair for midnight to whenever, and as soon as I hung up, it went pan the minimum style. Let's see what we got down here. Big shit outs, Jim. The Gallagate was madness. Who's that? Stephen Monaghan's own. Who you doing up, you mad crackpot? Whisking down! Fuck's sake! The parrot is single fished on the mellow birds. Unless he phones in to prove otherwise, he's under the table. He's singing Lena Martel. Started off with non alcoholic Chinzanos, and then somebody spiked to drink. And he's now up on the table giving it fucking Yaldi to Lena Martel feelings one day at a time. Sweet parrot. Give it a phone call. Sass, who's pumping the horn? Let's calm down. Fuck it, here I'll add to it. Yeah, we pump the pump gun. Oh, look, he's fucking wilted. He's took him. Don't fucking cut my grass, you. Here, cockle picker, don't be cutting my fucking. He's cut my fucking grass, look at that. Fucking cunt a kinty has just cut my grass here. He's took them for a fucking... He's took them for a peril diver. I bet he's took them for a peril diver. He's tripped right out his fucking diver, this crackpot. Right. Oh, fuck. Look who it is. I need to fucking hide here. This cunt will fucking... Shake me down for nothing. 
That is going down. There's a brother there. Oh, that is going down here. Does he hit somebody? There's fucking panda minimum here. Panda fucking minimum. Jesus, look at us. What the fucking all doing? Right. This place is fucking outrageous. Outrageous. Right. You're cashing, carrying it. Pirates are out style it. We're out here doing open wallet surgery. Open wallet surgery. The first bit of open wallet surgery. This year. And we're open to take your calls anywhere across the planet, free of charge, Tommy in Glasgow on the Skype. Or if you're on a phone, look at the service we provide, you can get us on a phone now. Oh, you go, hurry up, look, get fucking in there. And I'm in here, go, 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 we're in, we're in, we're in. Right. You can contact us, Glasgow, 141416-1888, Dublin, 01254-4567. Boston 617-963-0967, Melbourne 03-9013-67667, and if you're a brain dead daft zombie, you can get us on 0203-290-1690, get it right fucking up you, right, aye, aye, right, the dying embers of Glasgow, it's half past five. Crackpot McDougal time in a tinfoil covered Skoda. And we're waiting on a phone call here. Lassie's going mental. Who's gone mental? Smash him, Tommy. We've gone mental. What, am I cash and carry shot? Come on here, let's go. Where are you going? Where? Sword Street. Twenty pound, my man. Twenty pound. You're going, my man. You're going, brother. We'll get there eventually. <laughs> You're going, Sword Street. I was doing them a heavy disc out there for twenty bangers. This is fucking hog money. Hoots, man. There's a moose loose about this house. There's a crackpot loose about the streets here. It's a long, a long, long cold winter ahead. Oh, is that, is that why he, he gets scratched? He's been hit. The taxi has been hit. There's been a hit and run with a taxi. Kunta Kinti is out the motor. Oh, he looks livid. Let's get down here. Right, cash and carry. You getting on here, scamp Phil McDougal. We want, we want a report. Hands up in the class. Who wants a report from the cash and carry master? You want me to call you? Here, where, where's the mad, mad scamp? Never mind that. Where's the mad scamp? Now, by the way, is, it, is the call quality coming through good there? How's that call quality? Going to tell us, was the call quality good? Because I'm doing it on my wee dongle. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, here, look. We could have another bite. We've got another fish in the sea. I mean, as long as it doesn't do the crackling, then that means it's cool for me to... Seems all right, aye. Eh? Everything's going well. But this crackpot, he's not putting up. He's not doing it. He's blind me. I think the old Arkela's coming. Oh, I'm getting heavy blank. Heavy blank. He's a phone T. You want a phone call? Right, here we go. Where are we going? Where are we going with us? Has he seen it there? Here we go. Right, where are we going with us? Where are we? Right. 
A little bit of silence here brought to us by the noise of Bateman Society. Yeah. Where the heck is it? Can I see your number in this list now? Ah, there we go. There we go, we have left off. We have left off. Hello? Hello? Harry Krishna, I take it we're live. We're always live, bro, we're always live. We're doing shows everywhere, everywhere and anywhere. Not follow on. Happy, happy New Year, yes, guy. I'm paid in. Happy New Year. What's going down? Did you have a good one? You wouldn't believe if I told you what I was up to, mate. Pumpkin through the day after destroying the sun and John Hartson, obviously, with the with the, with the tube out. And where did you go? Where did you end up? Who did you end up with? I, I ended up at a French house. They all said Conians, and I ended up doing their buffet and running their bath for them. Aye. So I left there about an hour ago, mate, I've just come home. How was your house lined yourself? You get my thumb? Ah, it's been good. I, I was quite started off, man, Breed, but... Uh... Good to hear the cell block H or the H block cells, as I call them, to good day land on in uh, the irreplaceable Chaz Duffy this camp. <laughs> What you've got to call him is Tommy Wright, his nickname is, he's a cash and carry, Crawfoot, Kevin Costner, because he, body, he was a bodyguard of a certain Celtic captain once in Denver. Was he, aye? Aye, so he'd be cringing and he's had a few chinzaros probably, but uh, just call him the uh, Crawfoot Costner, that's his call sign. <laughs> <laughs> The Crawford Costner. Crawford Costner, Duffy, that's his name, mate. I won't we'll take anything else. That's his mantle for the, for the Ayatollah, a cash and carry. That's his handle. <laughs> oh, is that a popo? That's as well, there, a popo. Hold on. We might be getting shifted here. Yeah. Hold on. Oh, what's that crackpot? You nearly hit us. I nearly get hit by a fucking. These people are just lost the plot. Some of these drivers, ain't they bought their fucking licenses in a lucky bag or something? Oh, I know it's yeah, hell. Uh, it's totally nice. But no, I'd I, I recommend, obviously, I know you'd call it, but uh, the homeboys today was good. There's a lot of talk about Paul McStain, obviously, a good self come on, but uh, I had some, some, some good chat in it, mate. And actually, the boys, I think the blogs are back up. I should be a blog every day now on the old Lost Boys, so normal services have resumed. That's good, that's good. Hi, I'm looking forward to this new year ahead. It's all systems go, because... Well, I've, got, I've, got, I've got a plan going, mate. I want Lena Martell singing We'll Never Walk Alone before we the, the European Cup final at Wembley. Well, yeah, you can make it happen. Tell you what, it's up to, it's up to Lennon. Lennon gets his there. I'll get later <laughs> on in the park. <laughs> so as easy as that, as long as we get there, you'll get Lena there. I thought that Lena would be well, harder. Obviously, right, being at any international viewers, the um, Jules Holland tonight. It was a great show, Bobby Womack, the Dubliners, etc. And they all do Pichola clap to it's just a cash and carry Lena Martel to you. Let's not cut the crap here. <laughs> Obviously, Jules Holland and the BBC carry afford a proper artist <laughs> to go down to London and build a few tracks. So they, they dug out all day. Old Pichola was wearing an outfit that old drop bag used to wear in the 80s, mate. Always missing the Scrop King and half of them. Oh, well, look at the state of this. Dear goodness in heaven, look. Fucking. Some amount of yeah. fucking bangers in Glasgow, in there. So you just had a quiet night in a house, and is, is, do you say anything with some Sevkovians? Well, basically, it's, it's pals, mate, and very graciously they asked me over. It's because my folks died. I don't really do much at the New Year, so I was asked over in the. Uh, they had a bit of food to go and they don't had a few drinks and I went, right, listen, I'm, and even though I was wearing a fantastic Alexander McQueen t-shirt that the boat Crawford Costner did they like, but there you go. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait a bit. No, no, no. I thought I was getting something. I hey, carry on, sorry, on you go. So, uh, no, I saw I began in the kitchen and I said, right, you know, I'll, I'll take over the food. So it was just decor and 
pizzas and that. I stuck in the garlic bread and that bit. Uh, and I was running the bath a couple of years from the bill. Everybody sit in their ass, you know, there's not to be a... But a, a man like your good self provide a service to the drunks in the world. And a bit like myself, make sure they get fed and a bit of... A few Chinzanos in them and a bit of verse Picora before they all get home and do that when they eat each other, you know? <laughs> Uh, mate, as long as you had a good night, I just had a quiet one. I'm not worried. I'm not worried to see the family for the bells back out after 10, 15 minutes. But I should have took an extra half hour because I, well, it's always the same after the bells. I mean, it takes a while for people to filter out from their their abodes. I got offered 30 bangers to Nielsen, but my greed. I was asking for 40 bangers and I never got it. But say la vie. But listen, did you hear the news? I heard the earlier on. I don't know if it be confirmed, maybe. Uh, the Mr. Hugh Adams died today. Is that correct? Oh, I tell you what, mate, I've not heard anything about that, pal. I saw a Twitter on it earlier from, uh, I don't know where it was I've, from, but... I've, I've been up, I've said, obviously, I mean, I've not been on as usual, my, my usual standard, I'll get on there. I'll have a wee thing about, I've got a dressing so if he's passed away, you know what I mean? I know he did yeah. choose and... Jamie! That's me, Jamie Forrest. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah I'm on. No, it's no. Is he? Wait, wait, oh. it's not Jamie Forrest, is it? Is it? Hold on. Can he be? It looks like him, but. He's not playing. When are they playing? No, it's not. Can he be? It looked like him, I'm telling you, I swear. It was his fucking double. Hold on, here we go. Because... Sorry? How much do you want to pay? <laughs> 40 quid. Huh? 40 quid. <laughs> Each. Oh no. But listen to me, I'm going to, I'm going to have to scoot anyway and get under the, get All under right. the old cash. Sorry, fucking do me, mate. But, All right. Uh, I'll talk to you in the afternoon or whatever, but a big shout out to all the boys down under and uh, the bulk charge and all that. I'm, I'm, oh, I'm hearing yeah. rumours that you're getting a cash and carry Concord to get out today. I've been trying pick up all the scamps for the cash and carry Con Air trip to Wembley. <laughs> A grand, a kilogram of luggage, that's what you're charging. <laughs> that's too cheap, mate, that's too cheap for me. Oh, I tell you, you'd, you'd shame Charlie Green, you devil. A new year, a new start, you, you start playing the game, I'm a new Mother Teresa on wheels. <laughs> me and Charlie Green are cut from the same cloth, mate. If you don't ask, you don't you get it. You, you should be mailing at the cross out Koshner, unless like Charlie Green, repent, <laughs> Harry Krishna. Harry Carpenter, go and lay down and do Harry Carpenter. Uh, All right, Harry. I'll, 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 I'll sit in the chat for five minutes. I'll follow in the banner. God bless, Paul. Talk to you soon. Right, speak to you soon. Hail, hail. Right. Dear God, look at the state of this. Right, have we got any action here? Look at the state. He's got a luminous. Luminous. Mate, where'd you get any trainees for? Fuck's sake. Bright, luminous yellow trainees, Nike. Look at the state of him. He's a paraffin lamp. A paraffin lamp has just walked past with luminous Nike trainers. Fucking hell, man. That's what I'm trying to get him earlier. There's a paraffin lamp walking about with luminous trainers. Dear God, look at this, this lad has come down with one leg hanging out, with fucking red dyed hair. Oh, there's some amount of fucking rockets about Glasgow, I tell you. This is Rocket Radio, first thing in the morning. New Year style We carry on 2012 into 2013. There is no change, apart from the name. Yes, name change time, name change. My name now... Tommy Gold has departed the scenes. He was only here to try and fill a tripartite conglomerate of Mr. Green, Mr. White, Mr. Gold. Sadly, I only got a Mr. White and a Mr. Gold interview. I couldn't do it for Mr. Green. Despite walking into the clergy, despite having hours and hours of conversation with Major Rangers dumb schmucks. No, I couldn't get a, a, an interview with Mr. Chuckles, but God willing, one day it will still be there, and we'll resurrect Mr. Gold. But now we're on to a new trip, 
the new trip is also Glasgow Radio Online. Apart from Black Ops campaigns, Glasgow Radio Online will be retired, now replaced by Celtic Community Radio. Put that one in your diary. Save that one. Community, Celtic Community Radio. We're putting the unity back in community. No more fighting in front of the TV cameras. If we want to have a fight, we'll gather together in a wee square where the cameras aren't on us and we'll sort out our differences there. Mano, mano. We'll pull out straws. And then the person with the shortest straws gets to go in the gunge tank. And the person who wins the argument pulls the, the straw and it gets gunged with jelly and ice cream. Jelly and ice cream gunge tank sorts out the arguments and we do it behind closed doors. And the winner gets a mellow's buds intravenously injected if needs be to calm the fucker down. Come on, hurry up. We need a fair. We're closing the show down. As soon as we get a fair, it's over and out time. And uh, we'll be back in Jalemba. Or 2014, whatever comes first. I'm sure that was Jamie Forrest. Fucking sure it was. Right, we need a fame. Look who it is. It's fucking old Romeo. Tell me it's Romeo. No, it's not. Here we go, look. We could have business here. We could have some business. We get it going down. This is Glasgow Radio. Crackpot me Dougal. It's Crackpot me Dougal Radio here. Crackpot me Dougal. Crackpot me Dougal Radio here from the streets of Glasgow. Crackpot McDougal Radio. We're waiting for a fair here. We're haggling. We're haggling within an inch of our lives before the mad screw, the mad crew. Here we go. Can you, can you hear the reaction there? Can you hear the, the conversation? Can you hear the combo? Live action from Glasgow. Somebody's ran it. Fucking Billy Bunter has just ran it. He's running, he's gonna get fucking knocked in this crackpot. The shot, you're fucking having a giraffe. That's as well. Hi, Joe. Joe, Joe, Super Joe. So a big shout out for all you crack pots on the Chinzano, non-alcoholic of course I hope. And then let's see. Tommy Gold 2012. Tommy Gold is now old co. We're now on new co Tommy. New co Tommy is now Thomas J. Clark. This is not a joke. And uh, Yep, that's my name, Thomas J. Clark. Thomas J. Clark the third. I gave a little clue away back on the seventh, sixth of March last year. And a big shout out to the good people of the Huddle Board. Added to the achievement of myself in Poznan this year with the Celtic fans. Another magnificent achievement to add to third in the Vanguard Bears for Crackpot Tim added to that those two illustrious awards this season. I have also been given the fourth best huddler on the huddle board after the great Alan Mack. 
Bon Figley with his pervy videos and uh, the great Alvy singer I came forth out of, after that and I don't post that much and I post anything I do is a lot of shite and I'm a bit of a fanny and not everybody likes me so to actually get forth on that remarkable list is a, is a, a fine achievement as I say that ranks almost as high as because uh, I prefer I prefer my abuse column than my praise column so the abuse column from the 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 zombies, that third, I would say that's just a nice even for the fourth for the, the huddle board. Although the huddle board is the ultimate honour, yes, indeed. But I like I like a bit of uh, abuse. So to be the mo third most daftest Tim, then that's a beautiful award. Also, yes, another award that melted swallow swallow on the night of the Craig Whitey call. They didn't believe it was me, but I melted the fucker. <laughs> And yeah, and also for all the people who helped on the Craig White, the molligation, the complete and utter molligation of Craig Thomas White, one thread of the year, 49% of the huddle board voted that as thread of the year. And that was an appreciation thread of what happened there. So yeah, for me, I felt sad that 2012 disappeared, but it's onwards and upwards. I also felt excited because there's new projects and new plans in action and Celtic fans. We've got the creativity to pull it off. We've got the wherewithal, we've got the knowledge, and we've got the brains and the capability out there. Thankfully, some crackpot brains have helped me along, because obviously I've not got two brain cells to rub together at times. I just talk a good game, but... Really and truly, I'm just a fan Jeter. As my good brother Eddie Martin coined me, fan Jeter. God bless you, Eddie Martin, wherever you are. Eddie Martin for the planes. I'm bailing out here. This place is a fucking a ghost town. Ghost town here. We're bailing out here. Cash and carry time. We're bailing out. Fan Jeter's are us everywhere. Who's she then? I thought she was putting a Honda in her. No, she's not. Putting a Honda in her pocket to get some spags. Okay, and I'm bailing out of here. We're off the way to find a party now, we're off the way to find a party. Illegal parties are everywhere in Glasgow, so we're going to find an illegal party. Stay on the line, you're more than welcome to stay on the line. I've paid for my subscription for the speaker. Well, we might as well carry on with the show. What's that? You brought them down, Tommy. You brought them down. What's that? Cash and carry. What day was interview that you did that interview? Uh, the six. The six of March. I did it. Six of March. Six of March is what I, the day I did it on. That was the second call. Can you believe it? The six of March is the day we played Juventus. So on that day. I'm doing a 12 hour spectacular, I'm starting, I don't know what time, and God willing, if I've got the nerves to do it, I'll do a commentary, but fucking hell, don't expect anything decent as a commentary. No, I can't do it, because I, I don't bring it, it's never, it's never any good, we never get any anything good when I do it, I'd rather, it's the last couple of times where I've sat there, fucking doubled up myself. No, it's no good. It's no good trip at all. It's not even a good trip. I can't even sit at the fucking games. Dude. I'd rather listen to it. I can't sit and watch it. I can't sit at the games. And I, it's, I'm fucking only fit for the radio these days. I can't even do my own radio. I have to listen to fucking radio shortbread. It's L V. Oh, here. Anybody tell us when the... Uh, UV tickets for home, when's the, the thing, mate? 
my uncle's want me to go and get that sorted for him. I need to get that sorted. And, uh, Yeah, so you I need to get that sorted. Is it the 15th of January for season tickets? It finishes. Can somebody confirm that 15th of January? I know. Fucking, I've told everybody, mate. I've had CIA. I've had MI6. I've had every fucking crackpot under the sun trying to get me Chuckles' number. I've got his old number, I've got his old number and I didn't phone it. I thought it was a scam, I thought it was a fucking... And I thought, no, I'll, I'll wait. But no, I didn't keep the number going. Fucking amateur hour at the funny farm. Passing his number out. Fucking pass onto a professional. The bold devil's advocate. Fucking held on to it. And passed it on. And still to this day I've gave that number out to nobody. Nobody. Absolute nobody. People have asked for it. I've offered to do even a three-way call. I even offered that slimy bastard from Thingby that he's show anyway to do it. I thought, may as well let one of these fannies talk to their own fucking managers, management teamer, since they can't get the boys to, or the, the brains to get it themselves. I was going to leave it on a plate to see what they could do. And that's a charity of me, Want to help out a daft day like that, but hey, the bastards fucking anyway. Let's not talk about him, because we're onwards and upwards. Oh, uh, we're onwards and upwards here. Glasgow Radio Online has metamorphosized, metamorphosized now into Celtic Community Radio. Celtic Community Radio. We're out putting the unity back into the community. We're putting the unity back into the community out there. And we're telling 10 to tell 10. And all I'm asking is you to help me out. Tell 10 to tell 10. Sack Clyde. Back your team, Sack Clyde. Phone the homeboys. Encourage the rest of the people who are podcasters who are not doing the live shows. Encourage them as well. Give them your support as well. They're... They're the next broadcasters at some point. They'll be going live, doing live shows, no doubt. They'll have plans to do that. So you've got live shows, you've got podcasts, all your entertainment catered for every day of the week. There's a different podcast coming out there. God willing, we'll have a 24-hour Celtic stroke Irish radio station on the internet. With God willing, we can get a license, an Ofcom license, even for a month. The way forward, but if we start something up 24-7 on the internet, once we've got that going, that's how Sonny Govan did it. They uh, got a license for a month, and then they kept it going on the internet for a while, and they kept doing the, the one-off license type thing that you can apply for, the month license, what Radio Ramadan applies for, once you get that. And the technology now is... It's amazingly cheap, it's amazingly simple, it's amazingly easy to run your own radio show. It can be done by a crackpot driving around the streets of Glasgow with a headset on and a tinfoil covered Skoda. You don't need to be in a little studio in Clydebank or in Bailiston for real radio. To be running cash and carry radio, you just need a little dongle, a little netbook, not even a laptop, a fucking netbook, a £14 headset, a £12 a month software, a couple of subscriptions on Skype with five phone numbers. Bob's your uncle, Nell is your aunt, can't say fairer than that, or I'm the Bishop of Cork. Use a few strap lines from other presenters, a bit of cash and carry, a bit of plagiarism. Mix it all together in a big pot of the crack pot, psycho ceramic style. Give it a big blend. 
maybe throw a few beneficial herbs in to waken up the, the inhabitants. Give it another wee blend and what have you got? Crackpot McDougall Radio at 1 minute to 6. Is everywhere on the planet celebrated? Hug Mane, Hoots Man, has everybody celebrated it? Hawaii, they still to go, Hawaii, parts of the US of A, Mid Midtown America, Midtown America, has that gone down yet? Houston, Texas, are they ready for blast off there? The mad rockets down there, the Houston rockets? Are they good to go, are they fan eaters? Right, ah, my wee spot, my wee spot of solitude and privacy, my wee den, my wee private den here, away from the prying eyes. Uh, what the hell, my belly's rumbling here, I'm Hank Marvin, six o'clock and I've not had anything to eat in the new year. Rushing about like a green arse fly. I just closing my eyes, silent contemplation. As it rain peacefully drips off the car. There's something Rather nice about rain hitting the bonnet of the car that you're in. You can like, hear the rain, feel the rain, put a pattering down. But you keep nice and dry until you open up the door and then get feckin' soaked. And you run back in. Got a wee fox. Hey, foxy. Hey, scamp. Here. Come on here. Oh, you fucking ass! You little ugly verminous bastard, you. <coughs> fucking come snooping about here. I'm doing a radio show. Fucking sack of the blue. It's a sacred ground about here. This is a crackpot territory. We ain't taking any fucking ruffians about here. Try to muscle in. Yes, this is a chilled out place. I'm just chilled out here. Chilled out to the max, recharging my batteries. Anybody listen to the classical FM? Yes, I was classically trained at Irish rebel tunes from a young age. A wee bit of Mozart and Beethoven thrown in. But as soon as my granny and my nanny was out the way, then both soldiers are there. She walked in. Do, 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 do. Thirty years today, the internet. Thirty years. Happy birthday to internet. Happy birthday. Thirty years it's took. The sum total of thirty years. And what have we got? A fucking rocket sitting here talking flannel juice and rubber. Uh, flannel juice and gibberish. Can even bite bigger bunch of fucking rockets all across the planet. Listen to me. I mean, fling shite at the moon, ya fucking numbskulls. What are you doing listening to a crack bottle of me talking shite? Go on. Fucking sling your hook. That's it. An hour. There we go. 64. Nah, I'm only kidding. Don't sling your hooks. Right, so what do we do? Did I hear a wee bird tweet now? There's somebody fucking maddering us out there if there's a bird out tweeting. Oh, there we go. Tell me you can hear that. Tell me you can hear the bumps in there. Crack bumps. Can you barely see me? Do your facial and 
Yes, we're in tune with the birdie boys. Crackpot with Dougal Radio. That's a little bit of silence there brought to us by the noise abatement society. Right, I'm going to shoulder on and carry on with a few more pilots. The night is still young as I say, but first and foremost, I need to sort out my aching belly. Oh, I've got some food stashed away there. Oh, can I bother? Suppose might have to go to the wee roll shop. Have you got any rolls in New Year's Day? Some Morton's rolls. Sorry if you're listening across the planet and you're salivating at the good old Morton's rolls, the crispy rolls. You like the crispy rolls? A wee square slice. What do you put on your square slice and roll? Brown sauce, red sauce, just a wee smidge of butter. For me, to get that fixed these days, I have to batter over to Super Asia, facing the old Plaza Ballroom, where the boys in there mix together some pieces of lamb and breadcrumbs and what have you. And feckin' heckin', any time it goes in the grill, my mad so she has a canary fit in the smoke. Fucking Red Adair has to come out and put the fire out of the smoke out what the time these fucking blighters have been burnt. But they are nice. I throw back for myself because I don't have the pig's one. I don't have the pig's sausage. I have to go to the lovely Super Asia Halal Crackpot Butchery. Facing the plaza, yes. You go in there and ask for a pun of Halal. Halal Square. I don't have it all the time, but they can make it up in order, I think. Oh, you might be talking about food. Don't be talking about food. Fucking make this worse. My belly's rumbling. You hear that? I'll put my... We'll put a capture of belly rumble here. We'll put the speaker down. Should we get a belly rumble? Live and direct. You don't get any more fascinating radio than that. They're hearing the taxi driver's belly grumble that it's not had a bite to eat all year. All fucking year, I've not had a morsel. One morsel has crossed my lips apart from a chewing gum and a wee swally of ginger. Ginger beer. So, uh, we need to sort this out. This is because it's now dominating. It's, a no, it's now a dominating issue in my heat. My head is all encompassing of food. This problem needs sorted. What do we do? What do we do with a starving taxi driver? What do we do with a starving taxi driver? Early in the morning. We're no near Brigton, don't worry. We ain't anywhere near fucking Brigton. We're in my little base, my little chill out place. Shelter, a haven from the world of crackpots. A lovely bit of silence here brought to us by the noise of Aitman Society. I know we're off and running, here we go, we're off and running. Here we go, we're cooking with gas now, we're cooking with gas. And we're off ski. We're off for the races here, we're away to sort out the starving Marvin. The starving Marvin's away to get sorted here. We might have to take a wee break. Yeah, and if we use crackpots, Dane, I mean, fling shite to the moon. Stop following me about here at Glasgow when I'm trying to get my pirates or us. See, I knew it. the minute I would come on and do a show, I wouldn't get a feckin' fair. Sitting there waiting for a feckin' fair, and I didn't even get it. It was well on. So I crammed all my work in for this four hours slot between one and five. That'll do, mate. I'll wait to get a bite here. So yes, thank you for joining me tonight. Any mad crackpots, you can join the replay later on at some point. And, uh, oh, these streets of Glasgow are fucking brutal. See some of the holes, you should see them. 
fucking hit some of these holes. You end up near doing fucking Sydney, Bondi Beach. You're nearly hitting a Ch Chilean miner's fucking napper. And you go through some of these holes here. Fucking cash and carry these fucking roads. I'm telling you right here, I'm taking a break. Back in a minute, back in a minute. Back. Yes, we're back in it, we're back in it. Thomas J. Clark. On the ones and twos here. Formerly Glasgow Radio Online. Formerly Tommy Gold. Now Celtic Community Radio. And now Thomas J. Clark the third. Right here, I'm bailing in here. I need to go and see that. I need to go and investigate that shop here. See what's on. See what's on the, the go here. See if we can get some rolls on the go. We need to get something down here. We need something happening. Back in a minute, troops. Back in a minute, holding it down a lot. Down. Sorry about this.
and fresh free money. We demand that we want it. We want it now. When do we want it? Now. We want interest free. What do we want? Interest free money. We want it now. 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 Give us your money. Interest free. We want our money. Interest free. Interest free. Interest free. We're back here, we're back here again, live in the streets of Glasgow. Crackpot my Dougal style. Yes, crackpot my Dougal style in the streets of Glasgow. It's 17 minutes past 6, 17 minutes past 6 on the 1st of the 1st, 2013. So how are we going to call, is it 2013 or 2013? Are we just calling it 13? Unlucky for thir unlucky for some thirteen. Can it be any more unlucky for the brain dead zombies of Sevkovia land? Can it get any worse than twenty twelve? <laughs> Please God, yes. Make this their worst year yet. <laughs> Make this the punishment year. Twenty thirteen is going to be the punishment year. When they finally get their come up as instead of the pussy footing around. But well if you look at the plans that have been laid out, if you look at the the stuff that has been touted to bring them back in, catapulted back in the shite house playing it in the top division before technically it should be. Let's hope they don't get away with such fucking shady Skullduggerous dealings like that. Right. So let's see where we are here. You know what? I should run over there. Where are, sorry. Right, we're on the hunt for an after party. We're on the hunt for after party time here. Anybody know where the after parties are happening in Glasgow? Do you know what are happening? Well, come with me, I'll take you there. Let's see if we can find something happening there.
music of Mendel's legs. Yeah, so 30 years today. What has been the, the most wonderful achievement of the internet? What is the best thing the internet has brought to your life? The best thing the internet has brought to your life? 30 years to the very day since the internet was unleashed on the planet anyway. There was hidden networks, wasn't there, between the militaries? The military kept the networks hidden until it was released on the public 30 years ago today, 30 years ago, the World Wide Web. And then look at what has happened with people able to program, use uh, utility, use the, well, the programming to do all the wonderful stuff that we can now do. Who would have thought 30 years ago we could sit there with a little dongle, with a little laptop, with a headset, Talking to the planet, the radio, internet, radio. Who would have thought that? And a tinfoil covered Skoda in the streets of Glasgow, broadcasting to planet Earth. And we're on the Kingston Bridge just now. We're on the Kingston Bridge. Kingston Bridge, but it's not a problem. Laptops closed, can't see anything, got a headset safely around my head, one ear, hear everything that's going on, a wee Bluetooth headset, Bluetooth headset, safe and sound, legal, 100% legit, as always, laptop lid is closed, only time we open the laptop lid is we're pulled over safely, brake pulled at the side of the road. God willing, that's where we'll be very soon. We're going to be pulled over very soon. We're going to our, our place of abode, our temporary place of abode at 22 minutes past six on Tuesday, the 1st of January 2013. A momentous year has just ended and we're entering into another momentous year. Can the clergy be closed down for a second time? Only this time, proper liquidation happening. A proper pants down thrashing to the illegal shysters and dumb schmucks who have used voodoo economics and Ponzi schemes. It seems to decimate Scottish football with its corruption. Dodgy handshakes are all that are needed. No money or no fiscal reward required. Just funny handshakes to the max. And here we go, we're in it now, we're back in it. We're now doing it, pure pirates are us, ragamuffin style, raga style. Right, we're in position, we're in position here. That's me, chilled out again, chilled out position, relax, chilled out. Not a problem in the world, just recline it. You may have to wake me up here, by the way. Oh. That's me, I think my efforts are finished for the night. Uh, what's you still here, you mad fucking crackpot? So we ain't let me sleep here. I'm in position waiting for one of my mates now. What I promise, 50 bangers for a crackpot here if I waited. Fucking not even phone me yet. Right, we're waiting outside in the legal party. A housing scheme in Glasgow. Where is this crackpot? Come on to fucking. Right, are you still here? What are you all wanting? Yeah, uh, remember, tell 10. I'll tell you what I'm wanting. Tell 10 to tell 10 because in the new year, which we're in now, 2013, we're now putting serious pressure on a bunch of shysters 
who's raised in debt to us to be trying to do Celtic up like a kipper. We can all see what was happening. Old Shug Keevans has been banned from Celtic Park. Shug Keevans banned because of the shite. And uh, so do the same as their team. Ban, ban, ban. We all know Celtic ain't perfect. Neil Lennon ain't perfect. Mr. Lawwell ain't perfect. No one is perfect. He without sin cast the first stone. As they do say so. But anyway, listen, I'm out here. I'm going to chillax for a wee bit and uh, you all keep in touch with yourself. We'll do a live show sometime soon, remember? Six o'clock, six o'clock very soon of an evening, six o'clock of an evening with a live show with people from around the planet. Right, what's that? 86 minutes, 89 minutes, 87 minutes. Right, we're out at 87 or 88. There we go, 88. Another one minute of flannel juice and gibberish from me. It can be done. It can be done, yes. Your ears can take it for one more minute. 55 seconds to be precise. It's half past six. And uh, in the, mid the eastern seaboard of America, there was a crack pop we were going to try and get in Toronto, but he's bailed out on us. We're not a problem. There's a live show from earlier on, and earlier on today I made a quick guest appearance on Radio 5, Radio 5 Dead, 5 Dead, but I mentioned uh, the, f the hunger, the, I managed to get a whole load in, the hunger, the TIFO against Barcelona, and uh, a jelly and ice cream with Chucky Allah, yeah that's on my page there, so you can listen to that, jelly and ice cream with a Chucky Allah, with a whole explanation of the, the great hunger and such light and Celtic. So there it's there, that's us, 88 minutes, till 10 to till 10, crack pop McDougal has done it again. Another live show from a Fangita talk, flannel juice and gibberish. Big shout out to the good brother over in New York and a big shout to the brother over in Sydney, Jim and Chaz. God bless, God bless you both. Have a safe trip, Chaz, with your friends, relatives, whoever it was you were taking to the Empire State, was Empire State. Safe journey, take care, God bless to you one and all. Right, we're bailing out, we're going 44, right, nice symmetry, 88, 44. Right, increase the peace, fight the power, hail, hail, the Sevco are dead.